directed by Hi, this is Manas Vilas and you are watching Making of the Filmmaker ESFF event powered by Dios Film Productions. Emirates Short Film Festival is celebrating its 7th edition this year. Over 100 films right from US, UK, all across Europe, India, Pakistan, Philippines, Turkey, Iran, Egypt, definitely UAE too. All these films will be showcased right from 13th of December to 15th of December at Vox Cinema Dubai. Grand finale is going to be on 17th of December, the Friday. Dios Film Production is offering platforms to all the filmmakers to promote their films. Today, in our studio, we have a gentleman who is a former professor in State University, who is a consultant in a franchise consultancy company, who is a screenwriter, member of a screenwriter guild of Philippines. Yes, it's none other than Renato Nigdal and his team. Welcome. Yeah, please, please take some. Cool. Renato, welcome to the studio. Thank you very yeah. much. I heard a lot about you, you know, from the whole Philippines community, really, you know, you're one of the, that filmmaker, which it's an honor to have you on the, on, on, at our studio today. Thank you very much. Yeah. Renato, would you mind to introduce this beautiful girl? <laughs> Actually, Cherise doesn't need further introduction because <laughs> she is very famous and she's one of the more famous celebrities in amongst the Filipinos. She is uh, an artist. Okay, she does a lot of exhibitions, by the way, yeah. of her paint works. Okay. And she's a beauty queen, a model. Uh, she is one of the members of the cast of 1820. Ah, okay. So it's a film called 1820. Yes. So the name of the film is 1820. I think it's going to be exciting to talk about it. But before I go on that, if I'm not mistaken, Shiriz, um, are you a part of one of the Malayali film uh, by any chance? Yeah, yeah. I actually just finished um, one Malayalam film okay. um, starring Nareen and uh -huh. the Shrita. So it's going to be shown this 2021, wow. I hope. Yeah. So there has to be a big round of applause for a Filipino actress working in a Malayalam film. I think, you know, industry is evolving. Um, Coming back to 1820, yeah. the name itself is so catchy, yeah. Renato. Uh, I'm sure it's like 100 year old, something happening, I'm not so sure. <laughs> can, you, can you guide on this, please? Can you, can you throw some light on this film? Actually, it, the, the reason, one of the reasons why it was called 1820 is that the characters, the major events in the character happened during eight, the time 1820. Right. Okay. Unless, we cannot reveal to you the real reason why 1820, because it will spoil the entire film. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay, so that's the main reason. Okay. The main events happen every time that the clock ticks 1820. Right. Okay, but, but you know, is it something that you are going to take us into the era of 1800 by any chance? Or, or is it something just a name? What is it? Sure is. Uh, yeah, 1820 was set in a COVID-related world, so uh -huh. it's like um, it was literally literally shot in a um, COVID pandemic uh, era. Uh, era. Wow. So wow. everyone had to adhere with the local protocols to, you know, prevent the spread of the virus. Yeah. And yeah, it tackles more on family issues, about mental health right. during uh, the COVID. Okay. And yeah, the coming people, uh, coming together of people. In Right. Okay. Yeah. Is it something? Uh, I, mean, I mean, what is the genre of this? Is it a drama side, or uh, horror, or uh, it's a mix of? Uh, it's a mixed genre. Right. Okay. We try to make sure that people will think after watching the movie. Even us, when after watching the movie, okay, will our audience understand this film? Right. Because you have to put together the film in your brain. Okay. Okay, if you watch the movie Memento, okay. it's one of the two kinds of film that you have to put together the events. Right. Because that's the way the person or the character uh, named Matthew, Matthew. 
everything happens in his brain. Right. You know, during the pandemic situation. Okay. You know how much the mental health was affected by yes. the pandemic, right? Absolutely. So we tried to tackle that uh, element. So can we say this as a as a, as a pandemic film? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So 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 this is one of the pandemic film during the pandemic times. This has been this has been. Shot it, I would say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow, it's a bit challenging because of the protocols, as Sherry's would say. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah, and observing all those social distancing, yes, yes. trying to uh, put, make sure that everybody's safe. Yeah. Because we have a one of the cast members is a nine year old uh, girl, mm -hmm. okay, uh, who uh, is representing a very mysterious element in the film. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Well, again, it's a, it's a it's a round of applause we got to give you because you know during pandemic to make a film uh, and that also of this size, uh, I think it's it's definitely a great to talk about. One of the question comes in my mind. You know, obviously you have followed all those protocols and stuff, but but how much time does it take right from the scripting to the end of it, uh, approximately? Yeah, all the pre prod happened during via Zoom. Right. Okay. Okay. The pre-prod because we we in our team we devote a lot of time in terms of pre-production. Right. Okay. Trying to brainstorm the angles, the element, the story. Okay. So we it's so that when we go to the location, mm -hmm. everything moves so fast. Right. Okay. I think it's a one week already. We shot the the entire yeah. the entire shot one, 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 one weekend. Yeah. One weekend. weekend. One weekend, yeah. Actually, two, two weekends, yeah. yeah. Right. Okay. One or two weekends, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. And and then and then obviously uh, you know after that the post production took how long approximately? Yeah, for for the editing. Editing, 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 part. editing part. part. Yeah, approximately around uh, three weeks. Three weeks. Three weeks. So, so I would say an overall film made it within like I would say a good one and a half month, six weeks, yeah. eight yeah. weeks. Yeah. yeah. Right. And and what's the duration of this? It's a 20 minute film. 20 minutes film. I mean, 20 minutes film within six weeks, guys. Uh, you know, I think that itself is a, mm. is a great achievement. Mm. Renato, you are a screenplay writer of this film, yeah. 1820. Uh, who was directed, by the way? Uh, it was directed by Gilbert Bilieza. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, Shiriz, how was your experience? Because generally, when the writer is on the, on the set, it's not an easy task, you know, yeah. because he wanted to go line by line exactly. because every every line has a meaning. How was your experience working with him? <laughs> so uh, basically, I my, my role is Ruth, so okay. I'm like the best friend of the leading actor, uh -huh. which is um, Michael De Carey. Um, okay. He's not here, unfortunately. Okay. So working with the whole team, especially uh, Sir Anthony Dow, <laughs> it's it's like actually my first time working okay. with him. So, okay. Oh, right. So it's like um, his stories are more, you know, um, it has a deeper meaning right. compared to like other films that I've made before. Okay. So it's like um, having like, you know, those internalizations and you have to go through it one by one, especially with the lines. And right. Sir Atto itself, uh, himself is a very strict man when it comes <laughs> to his stories. Yeah, right. So yeah, it's, it's uh, basically... Um, challenging for me too. Right, right. I mean obviously thinking process and, mm -hmm. and observing and absorbing that yeah. that character and then protruding it back mm -hmm. is, is is always a challenge, especially with the film when you're thinking mm -hmm. you know that you it's it's a more of a thoughtful process yeah. more than an acting process. Yeah. I yeah. Say. Yeah. And even before actually uh, shooting the film, they were really given the orientation what mm -hmm. kind of character did I create? Right. What is the psychological reason? What's the social being of Got the it. person? Got Everything, it. even the story before the story yeah. starts. Ah, okay. So you I would tell them what is the backstory of the character. And, and all of this, you have done it in Zoom itself, so that you, you, you yeah, save exactly, a lot of time. Exactly, yeah, yeah. Well, that, that's So that when we go to the set, everything is set and ready. Yeah. Absolutely. And the director is the man of the, of the ship, you know? As a screenwriter, I put I move back. He's the man. Yes. 1820. Made by Renato Nekdao and his team. Come and do watch it between 13th of December to 15th of December at Vox Cinema Dubai. Grand finale is going to be 
on 17th of December, the Friday of Emirate Short Film Festival. Last question. Yeah. What's new? This is your fifth film? Sixth film? Yeah, sixth, I would say, because one is showing maybe around the Halloween. Right, okay. Which was sh shot last week. So, okay, so that last week. So I think you are keep doing this, and this is your sixth film. Yeah, but, but not my sixth script. Okay. Well, sixth film, but not a <laughs> sixth. Sixth. <laughs> okay. Um, one question is, what's the future? How do you see what's coming? You know what? I'm looking forward to a collaboration between maybe the Philippines and India. Uh -huh. Because I know both of the countries love cinema. Oh, exactly. We love movies. Yeah. Oh. So maybe looking forward to maybe doing a collab. Right. As you can see, uh, Sharice is starring <laughs> In an Indian movie. Well, I would like or, to work with her, you know. Yeah. For sure, for that sure. Would, that would give yeah. me more likes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll, I'll do one for you, for, uh, for sure. sure for Looking sure, forward for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Looking oh, forward okay. for you. So here is all about the film 1820 from Renato Nigdao and his team. Yes, please do come and watch it at Walk Cinema Dubai between 13th of December to 15th of December. Grand finale of Emirate Short Film Festival will be on 17th of December, the Friday. Yes, this is all about the film 1820. A big thank you to all our sponsors, Walk Cinema, Grand Stores, Nikon, Dios Film Productions, and many, many more. Keep watching Making of the Filmmaker. Till then, ciao for now. Thank you so much. Thank you. It was a pleasure to have you. It was really, really the <laughs> all the way, and it was sort of, uh, you know, but, but you, you, you actually spoke well, so it was, it was all good, and uh, thanks for all the... Dios Production.